defensively. And we weren't able to win any major honours. I mean, Tottenham, a lot of you guys, a lot of your defenders that were second fiddle were your bench boys like Dyer, players like Davies, that's another rotation player, um, are now looking like first teamers and looking like players that you are relying on. Um, where do you see the season ending for Tottenham as a Tottenham fan? Um, sick. 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 I don't that's, even know if I'm going to finish it. That's a successful season. <laughs> it is. Brandon's copy. Look at that. <laughs> so, sorry, sorry, Carl. Sorry, Carl. How, by, by the way, Carl, how, how old are you? I'm 26. You're 26. So you're the same age as me. That's right. That's cool. So, you know, it's, what can I, what can I say? It's, you should be used to this by now, bro. You know, Tottenham are yeah. only, Tottenham are just going back to where, you know, where they belong, mid-table. I'm sorry, bro. I'm, I, I don't like to – I know it's been a difficult defeat today in, as well. I don't like to rip into you guys too much, but I, I genuinely – and I, I mean this genuinely as well, right? I genuinely get sick and tired of listening to Tottenham fans, not necessarily yourself in particular, but Tottenham fans as a whole – trying to tell us that they're a big club just because they've got a, a brand new stadium and they've got Antonio Conte or Jose Mourinho, whoever it may be, right? When you've won nothing, I don't, like, it just makes, it makes my mind boggle. Like, me and Northside, right, we've been sitting here for as long as Northside's had his, his, his channel and I've had mine, calling out Arteta because we didn't think he was doing a good enough job. But before that, I can guarantee you as well that me and Northside were also calling out Arsene Wenger when he wasn't doing a good enough job. Was also calling out um, Unai Emery when he wasn't doing a good, a good enough job because we don't know what it feels like to be a like to be a mid-table club. Do you know what I mean? Like we're used to when we when we was younger, we were used to like winning things. We were used to being there and competing and stuff like that. Tottenham haven't competed for a league title. In I don't know how long. Do you know what I mean? Like even when you, even when you did that, um, you was the closest ones to, to to Leicester when they finished. You still managed to finish third. Like I don't get it. Like I, I don't know, bro. I don't know. Maybe maybe you picked the wrong team. Join join the dark side of North London. You know. What? Well, so you think I'm going to do what the guy did in 2001? Left us to join you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it. That's it, bro. Do a Soul Campbell. Soul Campbell. <laughs> um, like, well, hopefully Ben and Sim aren't looking at this. Well, hold up, mate. If you want to see it, here it is, mate. You want to see it, brother? You want to see it? Here it is. I'm wearing What's it. What's going on? What's going on? He's lost his head. What you're like, doing now, yeah? Like, I admit you are better than us, and but I think I might as well. Like, because I had some friends who support Arsenal, and I met an Arsenal fan called Sam in a pub. He was quite nice. He was quite nice. I met him. Yeah. yeah. So, fair enough. If you want me to do it, then fair play to him. Then I might as well, mate. Then, It'll be. Kyle, it will be the best decision you've made in your life. It will bring you a lot more happiness. I promise you that. It'll be. It'll bring you a lot more trophies, and you know, trophies bring happiness. I, I feel bad for Tottenham fans. I genuinely do, because if you're like, you know, if you're stuck in a nine to five job, it's depressing. And the only enjoyment that I personally get, knowing that I, you know, because I'm in a nine to five job like a regular person, right? Yeah. Especially when you don't like your job. It's depressing, yeah? So the only enjoyment that I get is at the weekends when I get to watch football. But if you're, Tottenham, if you're a Tottenham fan, you have no enjoyment in your life. You go to work, you don't enjoy work. You go and watch football at the weekends, you don't enjoy that either. You're like, oh dear, I feel bad for him. I really do. I really yeah. do. Yeah, now, Carl, you're doing the right thing, man. Become a gooner, bro. I'm telling you, it's long. What's the point? Yeah, I don't care about you. It's yeah, long. I've got Thierry, I've got Thierry on me on the back. I've got Thierry on me. 
because he's you know what? No, I'd, lo- I'd actually love you yeah, if you put Sol Campbell in the back. <laughs> uh, yeah, I might have to try and get that soon once I've sold a couple of these things. Like, I'll try and get that. I'll try and get that soon. Yeah, the, yeah, I'll get that one. And yeah, like that'll make you guys happy because I I watched every other and. I was only seven years old when Arsenal won the league in 2004. I was seven years old when you when Arsenal won it. So, yeah, like, it's 2.0. You can call me that. Sold Campbell 2.0. That's my name. And, like, welcome to the dark side. Welcome. Like, the, light, bro. the dark side is top. <laughs> Where you don't do nothing. The light is Arsenal. It is what it is. Listen, big up to you, man. Yeah. At least you got enough brains. You know what? Behind you as well, I see that Tottenham logo. Rip that down, bro. You got you got an Arsenal shirt on. You don't need that shit. You don't need fucking Nando's chicken behind you. You know what I mean? There's it's no a need. jacket, man. Like, allow me wearing this jacket, blood. Allow me wearing it, man. Less than that. Allow me wearing this jacket. <laughs> <Like, laughs> I've got on me, man. He's probably more better. Like, Anyway, let me, let me see the logo. Let me see the logo. Let me see the shirt. Oi, sourcing. See, it brings see? out the color in your skin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love it, man. Like, uh, you don't want that Tottenham shirt. It looks like unseasoned chicken. Yeah, you don't want like... that. You don't want that. When you nah. got Nando's, you don't want unseasoned like chicken. You know what I mean? You want it with the nice, the <laughs> nice tempeh, the nice sauce in that. Yeah, hey. that's it. You got. You got a proper yeah. logo on your chest now, Canon. You know, proper, proper Canon. Not a chicken on a beach ball and all that lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right, man. Like, yeah, I'm gonna try and go to an Arsenal game soon, but 